everybody, welcome back to my Project 13. This is the early morning vlog going through a Taco Bell. It's 12.26 a.m. This is my early, early day. I'm grabbing some lunch now that I'll be eating later. They stay open till around 2, 2.30 a.m. So I thought I'd take you through the drive through here at Taco Bell with me. Hope everybody's having a great morning. If you're up at this time, if you're watching this video later on in the day, have a blessed day. Thanks for coming on by, hanging out with me for a couple minutes this early in the morning. The Google event today, 11 a.m. Eastern Time, 8 a.m. Pacific Time. How many of you are going to be checking out the event? I'm sure there's going to be a lot of YouTubers covering the event. I am about sick and tired of hearing about the Google Pixel 3XL, specifically that device. We've had major, major rumors and leaks. We pretty much know what we're getting at unboxings hands-on pictures it's it's just gone beyond what we're used to seeing when it comes to rumors and leaks on any smartphone that will be coming out and being announced the Google event isn't about just the Google Pixel 3 XL it's about much more than that too but yeah I I'll be working I'll probably watch a little bit of it later on. And, uh, yeah, I mean, there's still the curiosity and intrigue, but I am about sick and tired of all of this info that's just been dropped. I don't know about you. Hi. How are you doing tonight? Good, how are you? Oh, good. Just be yeah. Would you like any salt? Uh, yeah, a handful of mild, please. Is everybody starting to recognize that you're open a lot later? No, not really, no. No, you're still, still kind of slow? They are still see tonight, but these last couple nights between 1 and 2, nobody really knows. Really? I do. <laughs> <laughs> really? Wow. Chit chatting with the Taco Bell employee. Really nice here. Treat me really good here. Every I come here every Tuesday early in the morning. Sometimes it's earlier than 12. That's okay. I think they got my order wrong, but that's all right. That's all right. Listen to a little bit of this. The Google event. How many of you are going to watch it? How many of you are going to skip it? You know what I'm really looking forward to is the Razor event. Sure. Sweet. Thank you. So I ordered with sour cream and they made them without. So now they have to make a couple new ones. So I get four total and all I ordered was two. So the Razor event is what I'm looking forward to. I'm hoping that there's um... cool. Thank you so much. You have a great night. I'm hoping that there's going to be a little bit of extra surprise with the Razer Phone 2 uh, because it's pretty much going to look like its brother, the first gen Razer Phone. And we've talked about all that, so we don't need to talk about that. 
I'm just hoping that there's going to be uh, a little few extra surprises we didn't know about, unlike the Google Pixel 3 XL and everything that we do know about with that device, which is, again, it has to be something really big to surprise us with the Google Pixel 3 XL. It, it'd have to be, yeah, I, I've been thinking, and I don't know, I mean, you guys and gals can throw some uh, comments down below some feedback and let me know what you think could be something that hasn't been shown or discussed with the Google Pixel 3 XL or the Google Pixel 3 for, for that matter. So yeah, maybe, maybe there's something we're missing and if you think you know what it is, you can leave that down below in the comment section. Uh, for me, I'm more excited about the Razer event. So we'll see what, what we're going to hear with that event, which happens tomorrow on the 10th. And uh, wow, I'm looking forward to that. I'm just hoping for uh, a device that at least, if it's not going to look that much different on the outside, that there's gonna be some really great changes on the inside underneath the hood. Um, and especially with the cameras that we're gonna get, not just cameras that can get the job done, but we're gonna get beyond that really great cameras that can challenge a lot of flagship devices and that we're going to get a great price point that's going to be uh, attached to this device that it'll be marketed a little bit better at least than again it's brother the first gen razor phone project linda will be uh, obviously talked about in more detail so there's going to be some uh in my opinion at this point in the game just guessing i, I really feel that there's going to be some good info uh with that but again, I know a lot of you are looking forward to the Google Pixel event as well. So, uh, Google trolling. <laughs> Is Google trolling all of us? I don't know, man. It's all part of the game. It's not what it, it's not what it used to be. There used to be a rumor here and a, and a, and a leak there. And now it's just, it's gone, gone beyond that. I mean, pretty soon we're going to start seeing them them meaning smartphone companies actually giving these devices out pre-production units most likely to uh maybe different youtubers different um, um folks out there that they choose to go ahead and start showing off these devices uh beforehand just to get us all wound up and going to get our minds focused on uh whatever it is that these companies are going to present ahead of even the events. Um, it, it, we, rumors and leaks will be something that will become less of because they're just going to go ahead and drop these devices out. And I don't know if they'd actually be the retail devices, but most likely pre-production units that we'll just start seeing reviews on. You know, like today's event, obviously you're going to see a slew of YouTubers that are on the large stage already with these devices. Uh, uploading their their videos uh, right after the event it's, it's just what we see a lot of now what I'm getting at is that this is going to start happening before even that uh, so there was a gentleman that had a, a Google Pixel 3 XL that put out a video I can't remember where it was from whether it was in China or Korea or somewhere somewhere overseas uh, but yeah that, that's what I I think in my opinion is going to start happening we're going to start seeing more of these unboxings hands-on beforehand and uh, and it's just not going to be Google it's going to be other companies you know this is becoming a uh, a competition that's that's intensified in the smartphone smartphone world there there are there are so many companies and there are more to come. Um, and there's a lot of them that are bringing out great devices at great price points. Pocophone F1 that I'm using right now to shoot this video in 1080p. Video quality is amazing, especially in these situations. Early in, the, early in the morning, in the dark like this, that most of you won't even be using your devices for it like I do. Right now, this, this looks great. Look at the video quality. For over three hundred something dollars, under four hundred bucks, I paid three. What was it? Three sixty-four. 
364 smacks, I think. But yeah, I mean, this is this is what, let me straighten this out. Okay. Look what you're getting. And there, there's a lot of companies with a lot of devices at great price points with really good to great specs that are competing within the three to four to five and sometimes you can find and I'm talking about hundreds of dollars um, and sometimes you get those devices that are 100 150 that surprise you for what they have and what they can do for you as a consumer day in and day out when it comes to performance and functionality now I just imagine if the Pocophone F1 did uh, have the bands that it needs for 4G LTE here in America. How, how well this device would have sold. Because a lot of you are nervous and picking it up because you don't know if it's going to work for you where you live. You know? And so, just imagine. And, 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 and yes, there's on the other end of the spectrum, you have devices from smartphone companies that are still selling at that 8, 9, 1,000, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. You know, Apple, Samsung. And, and there are other companies. And people are buying them. Consumers are buying them. And using them. And loving them. And you can't talk them out of spending that money on those devices. Even though there are other choices for a lot less. It's all what you want, man. You work hard for that money. You decide what you want to pick up. You know? I... I'm just... in awe of where we're at in the smartphone world and the competition that's out there now among the, amongst these companies. It's just crazy. Just crazy, man. That's crazy. Yeah, Google Pixel 3 event today. And uh, you let me know if you're going to be watching that event. If you're looking forward to the Razer event, let me know what you think of this video. Visually, the audio quality. You know, I'm just, I'm just rambling, man. I just wanted to talk. I'm not as tired as I thought I'd be this early in the morning. So I decided to just start shooting this video and whatever came out of my mouth, came out of my mouth. <laughs> Thanks for just listening. Um, if there's anything you want to add, add it down below. Um, that's about it, man. What's... What's next for all of you, man? I am looking at that OnePlus 6T that T-Mobile will be carrying. We'll be finding that information out on October 30th is when we should find out more about uh, when that device will go up for pre-orders, you know, as far as its release date and when T-Mobile will be getting it as well. Got a policeman there and a policeman there and there. Three police vehicles. Something's going on over there. The lights just came on too. Huh. Wonder what's going on. Oh, I'm going this way. Anyway, that's it. Um have a great day. Thanks for coming on by. Looking forward to your feedback on the Google event and the Razor event. I'm gonna start this song over here on my way out. My outro with a little Red Hot Chili Peppers. Have a great day, everyone. Thanks for coming on by. I appreciate your time. God bless. This is my Project 13. As always, you are my Project 13. Without you, it doesn't happen. If you're not subscribed, at least think about it. Hit that notification bell and hit it hard. And share the videos. Throw them out there. Throw them out there. Somebody's going to catch one of them. Become part of Team My Project 13. I'm out. God bless. <laughs>